Hey everybody, my name's Tyler Watson, your Las Vegas and Henderson Realtor. This is Tour Time with Tyler and welcome to Cambria Bay. Let's check out this one. But again, before we do, right there's the link to my resale app. Up above is the link to my new construction website. You can go to either one of those links or scan the QR code with your mobile phone and it will take you directly to them. Completely free to use. Let's check out this one. So, we are over here at Cambria Bay. It is a DR Horton build. Before we get into it, if you're thinking about buying new, you wanna buy new, you are considering buying new. Call me right away. Call me before you call the builder, before you email them, before you go and take a look at these pretty properties in person. I need to call on your behalf. I need to go with you the first time. Otherwise, you're gonna work directly with the sales associates. Now, I know a lot of them and they are awesome, but they don't represent you. They represent the builder. So they have the, the fiduciary responsibility to the builder. So if you want representation, give me a call. Again, all my info is down in the description as well as the pinned comment. It is a little breezy today, so hopefully the audio comes out well. I'm gonna spin around. Right there is South Point, so the 15's right there. And we are in Las Vegas today. So a little bit about this one. Again, DR Horton build, brand new construction. Today we are looking at the 1795. Before we talk about it really quickly, HOA is 40 here, uh, $40 a month. Lots are ranging anywhere between two and $10,000. And there's gonna be 210 homes in here. They're all gonna be right behind here. But this one is the 1795, as you can guess, 1795 square feet. Four bed, two and a half bath, two car garage. Now this will eventually be turned into the two, uh, two, excuse me, two car garage. That will eventually be turned into the garage. Right now it's the sales office. This is gonna start at 462.990. Now, if you could do me a huge favor and hit that like button. Also, if you wanna stay up to date on tours, make sure to subscribe. Now, coming on in with DR Horton, one of the nice things about them is what you see is what you get. So, when we're looking at these homes, it's pretty much gonna look exactly like this. They spec the home out entirely. They don't sell these until they're ready to go. So basically 30 to 45 day close on these, one of the nice things. So let's go ahead and head on upstairs real quick. So they're gonna pick the carpet, they're gonna pick the cabinets, they're gonna pick the countertops. So it's literally, do you like this one? If not, there's another one right down the road. So let's go this way. So you come on upstairs, we have a hallway, and then all the bedrooms are upstairs. So bedroom number one, and it's hard to tell since it is obviously set up as a nursery, but you could fit a full size bed. You could fit a nightstand and a desk, a dresser. I'm gonna be honest, cause the room is longer than it is wider. <sighs> it might get a little tight. I guess if you put a desk over there, you could get a dresser right here, but nice size room. We spin around, we have a big closet. Again, if you need more hanging space, move that bar and shelf up, add a second one, and you've doubled your closet space. <clears throat> Coming on down, we get to bedroom, or excuse me, bathroom number one. So we have, let's see if they're soft clothes. Uh, no, just standard bumper, but they're actually pretty decent hinges. You have your vanity top, and then we have our toilet. And we have our tub shower combo. This is a fiberglass composite material. So it's not grout, but it is easier to clean since there is no grout. You have your shower head, a couple of shelves for soaps and shampoos, your valve and your tub filler. Coming on out, bedroom number two. We've set it up as an office. So you can again fit everything. This one is longer wide than it is across. Again, you could do the desk, you could do a full-size bed, you could do a nightstand in here, but if you wanna set it up as an office space, you could do that. You even have like a little credenza over here. And then let me come on into the room. We do have another nice big closet. I love how much storage they tend to put in their homes. Coming on out, we have linens and then Bedroom number three. And you can see how these rooms are pretty good size. Full size bed, nightstand, nightstand. Here you could even put a desk here and then a dresser along this wall right here. We have our window and then again, nice size closet. 
I know some of these builders are making their closets so tiny and are also making their rooms so small, but not the case here. So if we come across, we have our laundry room. So you'll get the storage. I don't believe washer and dryer come with the house. I'll figure it out. And then you get your shelf. With other builders, a lot of times they'll offer uppers for cabinetry. They may even offer lowers, even a sink. Not the case with DR Horton. They make the buying process pretty straightforward and pretty simple. Coming on into our primary. That looks like a queen size bed, but you could definitely fit a king size bed. Nightstand, nightstand. It's a pretty large room. Oh, let's see if we can see some views. So again, right there is South Point. And then here are all of the lots where they'll be building the entire community. This just opened a couple weeks ago. So it is brand new. Coming on into our bathroom. Well, this is kind of cool. I know a lot of people will like this little bit of separation of church and state. So you have double vanities. They are separated. Again, they did a little bit of upgrade on the flooring, but it doesn't cost you anything. This is how it will come. You don't know if it's gonna be tile or laminate, but it will be a hard surface flooring. Here is our closet. So single bar, double bar, single bar, not bad size. And then we have a shower only. So bench, bench, shelf, shelf. There's your shower head, your valve. Again, it is a composite. And we do have a Vegas window. <laughs> I know I like to joke about it. I wish this was privacy glass. Again, it's Vegas, but not everyone wants to put on a free show. And depending on what model's next to you, there might be a window. But if we spin around, coming on right here, should be our toilet. So I do appreciate the fact that the door opens outward because sometimes it feels like you're gonna get trapped in there. There is our toilet. But let's go ahead and head on downstairs. See the kitchen, see everything else. Again, if you have any questions about anything I'm saying regarding this home, a different new construction, a resale, you need to speak with the lender and see what you would qualify for potentially. Give me a call. I can help you out with all those things. Again, all my info is down in the description as well as that pinned comment. So coming on in before we actually get into the main living portion, <clears throat> we have our toilet and we have our pedestal sink. So actually pretty nice size powder room. But coming on in, it's just one big open room down here. We have our living, we have our dining, we have our kitchen. I do like this. I like this layout a lot. Where should we start first? Let's go all the way in the corner over here and show you just how big this actually is. It's large. So living, kitchen, dining. So they have three different cabinet choices. They have the white, they have the gray, they have an espresso color. The countertops, I believe there's like two or three colors, but they are going to pick everything. Again, if you're not happy with that one, they'll have another one coming right up behind it with a different color. So you can go that route. Right here. Oh, I was not expecting the pantry to be this large. This is almost like a <laughs> laundry area. So large pantry, a lot of storage. Coming on over here. That is our two car garage. It is the sales office right now. And then let's turn on some lights. There's even more storage underneath. So you have your coat closet right here. There's a lot of cabinetry in here. So they did the 36 inch uppers with the hardware. You have all the storage and counter space right here. This is cool because it's almost like a little prep area that's kind of hidden. We have our stainless steel refrigerator. We have our four burner cooktop. We have our microwave and I do like to check. It does not look it actually is vented outside. So that is nice to know. Oh, are these sock clothes? Interesting, that one almost felt like it was sock clothes. If we spin around into the island, it is nice size. We have our dishwasher. We have our stainless steel undermounted sink. If you don't know what this is, this is a reverse osmosis water filter. There's some filters in the sink. So basically uh, purified water comes out of that. We have very, very hard water out here in Vegas, but big dining room table and you could see it actually fits nicely so you could probably put eight chairs at that table I mean you could go a lot smaller if you wanted to and then again we have our living space so one big giant open room down here now 
One of the things why I tell people to hire a realtor on new construction is because of the backyard. If you're not from Vegas, if you're from a different state, different area, you might not realize on new construction, this is what you're gonna get. You're gonna get these pavers. It's up to you to finish the backyard however you so choose. It's gonna be dirt. It's gonna look like those dirt lots we saw. So up to you to finish it however you so choose. This isn't a giant backyard, but if you have a backyard that can fit a pool spa heater, figure at minimum 60, probably closer to $80,000 before landscaping. So, you know, a nicely landscaped backyard with a pool spa heater figure, six figure range-ish. But again, call a realtor if you're thinking about buying new construction. Again, all my info is down in the description as well as that pinned comment. All in all, pretty nice place. What do you think about this one? Leave a comment down below. Is this your style? It's pretty nice and not bad for the price. Again, if you have any questions whatsoever, please, please, please reach out to me. Again, all my info is down in the description as well as that in comment. If you could do me a huge favor and hit that like button. Also, make sure to subscribe. And as always, thanks for tagging along with Tour Time with Tyler. Stay safe out there, everyone.